Hey everyone, welcome back to Product Critique. Today, we're diving into the Scuf Nomad, a mobile gaming controller that promises to elevate your iPhone gaming experience. We'll explore its design, features, performance, and whether it's worth your hard-earned cash. Let's start with the design. The Scuf Nomad sports a familiar ergonomic layout that's synonymous with Scuf's premium controllers. It feels great in hand, with rubberized grips that ensure comfort during long gaming sessions. The controller comes in sleek black and white options, maintaining Scuf's signature hexagonal pattern on the grips. Moving on to controls, the Nomad doesn't disappoint. It features responsive analog thumbsticks with a satisfying click, and customizable triggers and paddles on the back. These allow you to fine-tune sensitivity and actuation points using the Scuf app, which also supports profiles for different games. Whether you're into shooters or RPGs, having this level of customization is a game-changer. In terms of usability, one standout feature is its compatibility with iPhone cases. Unlike some competitors, you don't need to remove your case to attach the Nomad. This convenience may seem minor but trust me, it makes a big difference, especially if you're protective of your device. Now, let's talk performance. During my testing, I found the Nomad delivered minimal latency. Inputs felt instant and precise, crucial for competitive gaming. Whether you're playing offline or streaming via services like PlayStation Remote Play, the Nomad keeps up without missing a beat. So, should you buy the Scuf Nomad? If you're serious about mobile gaming and value customization and comfort, absolutely. It's undoubtedly one of the best mobile controllers for iPhone users right now. While it's not perfect mainly due to the charging limitation it excels where it counts, in performance and user experience. And that wraps up our review of the Scuf Nomad. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more in-depth product critiques. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if you've tried the Nomad yourself. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.